little gardener. <laughs> oh, you're running away. Are you coming to help? <sighs> Hi everyone. We are doing a quick day to up the day to garden Thank you. Still getting some cucumbers, even though there's lots of powdery mildew from all the rain we've had. And lettuce is growing. Nice nasturtiums. Marigold. Samazano paste tomatoes. Brandywine pink. Ginormous Brussels sprouts plants. Got some. Can't do it. Can't see through the netting. Yeah. Some peppers. Some red cabbage. Some more vine tomatoes. Vining, creeping everywhere. Self seeding kumara from last year. Self seeding tomato from last year. My new little hens trying to dust bath their way into the veggie garden. And the beans are <clears throat> coming to an end. Ready to do some canning. Okay, we've got everything ready. decide if it is still summer or autumn is well and truly gone the way it's definitely been colder in the mornings but right now it is roasting hot out there I'm just going to harvest as many tomatoes as I can and try to do some canning tomato sauce um, I'm just trying to decide whether to do all San Marzano as I'd intended to as they're a paste tomato or if I will mix it with the Amish heirloom brandy wine pink and Tommy, Tommy Toe, I think it is, is the other one, and then I'll just have a lot more, so I'll see, I'm going to weigh them all once I've picked them and see what I'll do, but it's a nice day. Terry and my dad built this um, frame out of bam the neighbour's bamboo, and uh, the tomatoes have been so heavy that I've been, totally bent with the small end of it and coming off the frame, so um, I'm going to use this system again next year I'll have to use a whole lot more of the thicker stuff but it's actually lifted off the ground down here because the tomatoes are so heavy. Those are the San Marzano. Brandy wine pink up. They look quite sparse because I have cut off all the lower leaves, lower for airflow. So right now Danielle's digging up some kumara that actually came from last year's crop. Got totally sidetracked in the garden and pruned some lavender and got my tomatoes. Also dug up some carrots. Danielle came and dug up some kumara that had was left over from last year, self-seeded. Spread everywhere, it was ginormous. Um, and I've come inside and she's been cooking and it smells so good and I'm so hungry but I just figured out why they call it green thumb. I think it's something to do with tomatoes because my fingers were very green. Yes. And you should wear gloves when working with tomatoes because apparently even people who work in tomato houses, pack houses, get um, develop allergies to tomato fire. Here's my tomatoes, not a huge amount but I'll see what I can make. And the anime has been flowers. Oh, and I've ever grown. 
Beautiful. So lavender. Is that pretty? It smells really good. <laughs>